We have decided to invest in the solar system because it is our opinion that in years to come, once the system being paid off, we will be able to make a substantial saving in the ever-rising cost of electricity. There will be carbon emission benefits. We will be saving approximately 360 tons of yearly carbon CO2 emissions. Uh, added insulation, and then we are passionate about the environment, greening, saving costs. We approach specialized solar systems because we believe they are the leaders in the energy saving business. We've had some very good referrals from friends and specialized solar systems mention suggestions that made us very excited. Suggestions like lighting up Africa, affordable electricity for the needy, statements that made our hearts leap. The installation is a 200 kilowatt peak installation incorporating 650 solar panels. We have seven inverters, grid tie. In order for us to begin the project, we had to go on a various number of training courses, health and safety, training at heights, first aid, firefighting. All these different disciplines had to be required before we could even set foot on site. Staff are equipped with all the health and safety equipment. We've installed a number of safety points on the roof, anchor, balustrading, where we can clip on when we come close to the edge. Our project started um, around about eight months ago when the owners and management of Tembaletu Square approached Specialized Solar Systems with a view to designing and installation, a PV grid tide installation that would assist them with the reduction of their energy needs and energy costs. As far as the grid tide system is concerned, the process that we followed was um, quite an onerous process, but we had to do this to ensure that we complied in all respects with legislation and to meet the customer's needs on the energy systems that were designed. This included the commissioning of consulting engineers that assisted us with structural engineering diagrams for the roof, electrical specifications, as well as some mechanical specifications that were required in terms of this project itself. 